What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to a uh, brand new video. In this one, we're checking out Season 3, Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War Trademark. I'm excited for this one uh, because of the multiplayer side mainly, not really so much zombies. We'll get into that here in a second. But I thought we'd go through the Battle Pass. Uh, there's a free bundle in the store that I see. We'll go check that out. And then we'll go check out the new Outbreak Zone, Duga. And that should be a pretty fun time. Warzone, at the time of recording this, the new map comes out in uh, four-ish hours. So, whenever that comes out, I guess I'll, uh, I'll grab the squad and, and we'll, we'll drop in and see how, what it's like. But until then, let's see what the hell this season has to offer. Alright, so... I kind of already looked at the battle pass. It dropped last night, and I was like, I, I, I have to see it. So I launched it up. I looked at it. And then I was like, I have to buy it. I just have to. I just kept repeating that because this sees that this battle pass is leagues better than the past two. So we get our new operator wraith. She's dope. Oh, yeah. You can also play as Captain Price now. So you care I, I guess there you go but you get these cool skins now this looks sick it has like the carbon fiber mixed with like the red it looks really fucking good for an aug big fan of that and then you get you know some some strange stickers and and other shit which a bit filler wish they could have chosen something else but then you get the ppsh a very fucking excited for this I'm, I'm wondering what it's gonna look like with dark ether dark matter on it very excited for that uh this is one of the worst skins i've ever seen i haven't actually seen this till now wow uh then you get this free uh xm4 skin really dope but then you get this this when i saw it i was like holy shit it's they they literally made a damascus qbz and it looks fucking sick as fuck you also got a little bit of carbon fiber you got the mat dude sick and then oh my god the shoddy i am a sucker for the etching and like roses and shit a big sucker for it and holy fuck it is such a good skin L like just look at the preview holy bro Th this one's pretty cool the stainless uh what is this the uh Story, man. EMR, yeah, that's pretty dope skin. We have this. This looks fucking sick for a stoner skin, bro. What? The twisted barrel, the fucking little detail there, dude, looks sick. Then we also have the Black Ops 3 mixtape, which, oh my god. It's throwing me back. It's throwing me back. I could feel sitting in that lobby as Richtofen or Dempsey or whoever the fuck I am. Eating a can of beans around fire. I can feel it. About to hop into one of the best zombies maps I think has ever been made. Shadows of Evil. Anybody else getting the fucking goosebumps, bro? Holy shit. This is kind of sick, too. I like how it gl It looks like it glows a little bit. Not reactive, but you know, it glows a little bit. I'm also a big fan of this. The, the, the handles and the grip and shit. Oh my god, I love it. As well as the little etching right there. Oh. And then we got uh, an AK skin. I think this is pretty cool. It's like an alien type thing. I think it's dope. I don't care what you say. It's fucking sick. Then I saw this. An MP5 Ultra Mastercraft SMG. Look at this. This just reminds me of like 9. Like the zombie map 9 from Black Ops 4. Just how like there was like marble statues and shit. This is sick as fuck. I wonder what camos look like on that because this is this is one of the best camos i've seen Ooh, we got a fucking far see I, i'll use this a hundred percent take the attachments off and customize but i'll use this fucking blueprint for this camo hundred percent bro i love using the far in war zone i'm digging this calling card this calling card's sick and then we have a reactive ppsh Oh, that one's sick as fuck. And then we have the same type of style for... What's this? Oh, this is the new sniper. Oh, shit. But, dude, this is sick. This whole pass is sick. I'm excited to start unlocking it. I definitely think I'll get to a very high tier. My hopes are 100. 
uh, but we'll see how that all goes. Uh, realistically, we'll, we'll have to see how that goes. Well, the ballistic knives, chat. I don't know why I said chat, but that is sick. My friend would love this design. He would love that. So, speaking of the new weapons and shit, uh, in zombies, they added the ability to uh, unlock guns yourself. Uh, in, in here, there's like their own set of challenges. Like, I already have the sledgehammer, for example. Um,. So if you go here, melee or kill 300 enemies while you're using a special or melee weapon that is epic or legendary. I'm just glad they added that to zombies because I know a lot of people don't want to load a multiplayer, me included. Like sometimes multiplayer is just a little bit too much. So I'm glad they finally added that ability to zombies. Also, they added toxic growth. Never going to use it, but I'm glad they are starting to add more field upgrades and stuff. It's just Ring of Fire is just still way too fucking good. I, I've literally never used Healing Aura, Energy Mine, Frost Blast. I haven't used those three. I probably won't use Toxic Growth, I'm being 100% honest. Frenzy Guard is kind of cool too, but... Dude, it's, nothing's beating Ring of Fire. I'm sorry. I guess now let's hop in because they did add Duga. Uh, the last thing we're going to check out today. Um, so let's see if we can actually get it first shot. 